Father Willie, in his homily, talked about the fact that you can never answer the question, why, satisfactorily. You won't find a good reason why this happens. And I think when we can't find an answer, it makes us very afraid because it digs into that fear of uncertainty and that fear of the future. If we can say why, then we can try to avoid it. If we can say why, then we can try to make it different. But if we can't say why, sometimes it's scary. But I think one thing that is important for us to reflect on is that this horrible event is not a typical reality in our life. This horrible event is in part so horrible because it doesn't happen, thank goodness, in many instances. And so as parents are reflecting on this and they're thinking about their children and their children's safety and their family's safety, we need to realize that there is a goodness in our world that overshadows all of the evil. And there needs to be that basic trust that we instill in ourselves and in our children, and it comes for us from faith that there is a loving God who will take care of us. But in that trust, we can go into the unknown and the unexplained and find some security that God will take care of us. You can look at this circumstance that happened today and say, It was an absolute horrific tragedy. But you can also see hundreds of people who immediately responded, who immediately were there, some probably without disregard with with disregard for their own safety, for the sake of others. That should also be a powerful memory for today. That goodness always wins. And so that belief and that trust in that reality, the whole Easter message, should be somewhat helpful to us in moving forward. There's always going to be that fear, and particularly after an event like this, it takes a while to get back on the bike. But the reality is, Jesus challenges us to stand up and trust. And as Father Willie said at the end of his homily tonight, the peace of Christ begins with each one of us. And that's what we are to be about as parents, as friends, as family, to create that peace and allow it to spread out and be a cover over anyone who's afraid.